Hey everybody, Red Diamond Shalua back in here with another video. Today we're reacting to another Generation Hope video. Black man saves racist cop from dying. What happens next is shocking. This video was once again requested. Let's get into it, guys. I thought your job was to serve and protect people. Hey, hey, boy. People. That's right. Dirty monkeys like you. Dirty monkeys? Oh, no. Nah. It popped and went in his face. Oh, snap. That's what he get for, for being racist and calling black people dirty monkeys. Hey. Hey, man. You okay? Hey. Hey, are you okay? Earlier that day... <laughs> Hey, bud. How you feeling? My throat is scratchy. Oh, come on, man. The doctor said that would happen. Yeah, I know, but it really hurts. All right, look. Here. Have some water. There you go. Thanks. Of course. I'm really glad you're back, Dad. Me too, son. Look, uh, I'm sorry that I haven't been there for you over the last five years, James. It's okay, Dad. No. No, it's not. Every boy needs a father. And I should have been there for you. I'm gonna make it up to you. It wasn't your fault you got arrested, Dad. Those guys snitched on you. They should have had your back. Dealing drugs is illegal, James. And I can't blame anyone but myself. But now that I'm out of jail, I'm gonna get you that surgery. But we can't afford it. Uh, I was I'm gonna save up. I got a new job working construction. We'll have the money in no time. Really? Oh, yeah, and construction workers make pretty decent money, you know, pretty good money, you know, so. Sure. Listen, James. All those years in prison taught me some good lessons. Like working really hard. Living an honest life. Being a good and kind person. But the most important lesson is that life is going to test you. Life is going to tempt you. You can take the easy way out, or you can do the right thing, no matter the consequences. I will, Dad. I love you, son. I love you too, Dad. <coughs> the cough is getting worse. Yeah. All right, I'm going to head to the store, get you some medicine for that cough, and something to make your throat a little better, okay? Okay, thank you. All right, I'll be back in a bit, bud. You know, I'm actually gonna get the coat back. The one I've been talking to you about, the one that costs like $100,000. I've been dreaming about that since I was a kid. How come you want to get one so bad? You said it reminds you of your dad? Yeah. Yeah, Pops had one for a little while. He want to get one? Is he talking about a black person? I'm just guessing, though. Oh, yeah. This is it, Johnson. Should we move in right now? No, 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 no. no. Wait, wait. They actually make Or is he just saying he wants to get a drug dealer or whatever, you know? Hey, bro, you got my stuff? Yes, yes, he's all here. Here he is. Grab it, grab it. But no. Yes, shut up. You want us to get arrested? Man, yeah, ain't no cops ever come around here. Man, you should still be careful. Shut up, give the money. Bro, how much? Three grand. Three Man, it's hard to get this shit. It's not easy. Yeah, whatever. All right, Three grand. Go. Let's do it. All right, let's get these bastards. There they are. Oh, 
oh see they started running I feel like that's how they probably end up catching catching the other dude because he, they probably got mixed up and lost. What the heck, man? Hey, man, uh, watch it. I think he grabbed the wrong bag. He grabbed his bag instead of the bag that he really dropped. How he get those two bags mixed up? Cause the other bag is see-through plastic and then his bag was white plastic. So that don't make sense. Hey! Stop. Oh, okay. Hey, you stop! I... Well, no, I guess I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm gonna just play it. Said stop talking to me. Yes, I'm talking to you. Turn around, put your hands on your head. I live right there. I said, turn around and put your hands on your head before I shoot you. Okay, okay. Relax. I'm he ain't do hand. nothing. Behind my head. Turn around. And I'm turning around. Turn around. Get on your knees. You done what I'm being arrested for? Shut up. Okay? You know what you're being arrested for. Don't even try it. What are okay? you talking about? I live right Left here. But every race be thinking all black people look alike. So I'm not surprised that he did just mistaken this dude. Right hand back. Dude, Thank I you. I live right there. I don't care. Get up. Get up. Alright, thought you could get away from me, huh? But he happens to be Spread black, out. just like the other one. I'm telling you, you're making a mistake. Hey, shut up! God, you blacks are all the same. Oh my this god. Guy, this is my you said you black, so. Yeah, I got one cut one in custody. I just bust up a drug deal. The other one's on the run. Cruz is after him. Send him back up, please. This is dispatch. Stop Myers. Wow. Roger. Man, I'm telling you, I didn't buy any drugs, man. Oh. So what's in this white paper bag, huh? Man, that's medicine for my kid. Medicine, yeah? Yeah, but dude did grab the wrong bag then. Okay, so both of their bags was white. But okay, so it was in a, okay, so that was put in the white bag. Okay, that's why I was confused because I thought he was just carrying that, just like that without a bag. Is that what they're calling it these days? What? Hey. Hey, look, man, that, that is not mine. I did not buy that. I, that is not mine, I swear to God. Look, I haven't heard that one before. Really? <sighs> Listen, man, I went to the store to go get medicine for my kid. He's sick. Your kid, huh? Yeah. Probably just raising a little drug dealer. Wow. Hey, you, think, you think I'm a drug dealer because I'm black? Hey, you're, you're all the same. You're all the same. Look, the guy that bumped into me, he had a white paper bag. He, he must have picked up my kid's medicine by mistake. You're gonna have to come up with a better story than that, bud. Come on, man, you gotta believe me! Shut uh. up! You know what? I'm gonna make sure you rot in jail. Nah, and it wasn't even him, dude. Come on now. This is probably gonna get you 25 to life. That means you're stupid, cancer-ridden kid. He called his kid stupid, cancer-ridden? What the heck? He's gonna die all alone because daddy is locked up in jail. And nothing gives me more pleasure than watching you dirty little monkeys caged up to die. Wow. I thought your job was to serve and protect people. Hey, hey, boy. People. That's right. Dirty monkeys like you. All oh, people, bro. Come on. First of all, I'm thinking right now, why did he grab it and squeeze it that hard for it to bust? Like you it shouldn't have bust if you just grabbed it at a normal normal grip. Hey, man. Hey! Are you okay? Hold on, hold on. Please, please. Oh. Yo, is that. Is that fentanyl? Oh, shit. 
Hey, man, hey, I think you're overdosing. We're going to get you some help, okay? Hey, um... Dang, uh, that stuff just hit him in the face, and it's like an overdose? Like, like that? Dang. Uh, do you have anything to fight the overdose? Um, uh, uh Narcan, uh, something. In the car, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, he's trying to do all this fucking handcuffing. Hey, 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 I can't reach it. I can't reach I need the keys, man. Do you have the keys? I need the keys. Take the cuffs off. Come on. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. All right, all right, I got you. Hold on, hold on. All right, we're right here, we're right here. Hurry, 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 hurry. I think he was thinking about just letting him die because he was treating him bad, but I think he gonna have a change of heart. 25 to life. That means you're stupid, cancer-ridden kid. He's gonna die all alone because daddy is locked up in jail. And nothing gives me more pleasure than watching dirty little monkeys caged up to die. Uh, monkey, huh? Yeah. Oh, he gonna leave him there? <laughs> nah, he ain't gonna quit. All those years in prison taught me some good lessons. Like working really hard, living an honest life, being a good and kind person. Gotta be that good and kind person. But the most important lesson is that life is gonna test you. Life is gonna tempt you. You can take the easy way out or you can do the right thing no matter the consequences. I will, Dad. I love you, son. I love you too, Dad. <laughs> Come on, Dad. Alright, hold on, hold on, relax. I got you. Wake up, wake up, wake up. There you go. 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 Alright, you think you can stand up? Alright, on three. On three. One, two, three. There you go. There you go. Let's get to the car. There you go. So is he still gonna take him to jail or what? Relax. Relax. <laughs> he look at him he <coughs> he like shit i guess he's still thinking me to jail so i'll put him back on <laughs> what are you doing i figured you want these back on i am not arresting the man that just saved my life well i uh i appreciate that and if it makes you feel any better, I didn't buy those drugs. You were telling the truth the entire time. He was right? telling the truth. Yeah. I'm sorry, I, I, I let my ignorance get the best of me, man. I judged you on the color of your skin and what you're wearing. I just, I let my personal bias get the best of me. I'm so sorry. It's okay. We all make mistakes sometimes. Word of advice, next time, don't judge a book by its cover. Right. So, uh, your son, what's he sick with? What's wrong with him? He's, uh, he's got throat cancer. And the doctor said it's not looking good unless he has surgery. And I can't afford it right now. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, I guess I better go get him some more medicine. Sure. Am I free to go? Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're free to go. Aw. Malcolm. Malcolm, come here. Come back. <laughs> I've got little money saved up. Let me pay for your son's surgery. He's about, oh, he's about to help him. Oh my gosh, this is a blessing. I appreciate it, but nah. Look, let me do this, all right? 
I've had this dream of you owning feel bad for old school Corvette for years, and I've been saving up for so long, but your kid deserves a life. Please, let me, let me pay for the surgery, okay? Hey, Amen. you don't have to do that. So at the beginning, he was talking about that he wanted the Corvette so bad. That's what he was talking about. We're good. Your kid's life is more important than some stupid car. It's the least I can do, man. He saved my life. Officer Myers goes back to Malcolm's RV and meets James. Uh -huh. Malcolm allows him to pay for the surgery, which ends up being a great success. Officer Myers also helps Malcolm get a better job so that he and James can move out of the RV. Uh -huh. Remember everybody, we need to treat everyone with respect and kindness. Yeah. No matter what we look like or the color of our skin. Because we're all human and we have a place in this world. Thank you yeah. for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I love this video. And stay tuned for more. I'm out.